Now, a group of concerned residents from Asaba is raising questions regarding the selection process for the 14th Asaba of Asaba. They organized the march through various streets in Asaba to voice their concerns, saying that the nomination of Professor Epiphany Azingi as the candidate from Obomanta Quota did not adhere to proper procedures. They urged the Asaba Council to uphold the principles of Asaba culture in the selection and coronation of the Asaba. He is, his criteria is CV beautiful, everything beautiful. But as much as we are concerned, his interest for Asaba is zero. This money they are throwing about, cowing people from protest, doing all this manner of things is to show you he's not a choice candidate. If, if he's the choice candidate, they won't do this they are doing now. As it seems like our tradition, uh, the traditional system has been truncated. Uh, we're not against uh, Professor Epiphany Asinge. We're not against anybody. As much as we all have our candidates, we want due process to be followed. Number one, if if this if this is not done, it is going to set back precedent, and that is what we are trying to avoid here. I don't know the criteria they use to select two names. We have a candidate. Our candidate name is not there. So what criteria do they use to select those two names? That is the problem. So what is your prayer now? This medium. To tell the world that what we are seeing is not what we know. When my grandfather, our great grandfather, is not a due process, like I have said. You understand? So you cannot impose candidate on us. There are other candidates. And there is a petition before the O2 Hazard against the way from welfare and Professor Kifani has in the result of it, and that is what we are trying for. That is allow the will of the gods to prevail, not to the will of the uh, land. For them, uh, this is not merely a protest, rather it is an expression of concerns regarding what they perceive as irregularities in the process of announcing appointing the new Asaba of Asaba. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.